Welcome back everyone. Today we're gonna take a look at the top five hidden gem war movies on Netflix right now. Let's jump on in and take a look at number five. In Madhausen, todo está preparado para impresionarte. Coming in at number five is The Photographer of Mauthausen. The film tells the true story of Francisco Borsch, who was a photographer at the Mauthausen concentration camp in Austria. Francisco, with the help of his fellow prisoners, would risk his life in order to take and preserve photographs of the terrible conditions and crimes taking place in the camp. The Photographer of Mauthausen is a superb film that can be a powerful yet emotional watch. It's well made despite a low budget, but unfortunately, it's woefully underwatched despite being in nearly every Netflix region. Next time you're in the mood for an incredible true story, give the photographer of Mauthausen a shot. At number four is First They Killed My Father. The film takes place in 1975 and follows a young girl who's trained as a soldier during Cambodia's Khmer Rouge regime. The film is a Cambodian-American joint production and is based on the memoir of the same name. The Khmer Rouge regime was responsible for the deaths of nearly two million Cambodians and this film reveals these horrors to us through the eyes of a five-year-old girl. The film The Killing Field certainly comes to mind when remembering this bloody period of history, but while First They Killed My Father is not quite on the same level as that 1984 classic, it's definitely still a powerful and worthwhile watch. I worry about my dad at night because it's like dark and they can sneak and then they can go Taking our number three spot is Father's Soldier's Son. This is a documentary that follows U.S. Army Sergeant First Class Brian Eich and his two sons over a 10 year stretch and shows how his deployment to the war in Afghanistan affects them all. You'll be hard pressed not to break out the tissues during this film as it is one of the most emotional and powerful docs you will find on Netflix. Showing the often overlooked perspective of how war also affects the families back at home, the story of a single dad veteran and his boys is a true gem. If you find yourself searching endlessly for good movies to watch on Netflix, why not let me do the work for you? I scour the depths of Netflix every week to find the best of the best in every genre, so make sure to hit the subscribe button and enjoy the best that Netflix has to offer. Rooting up against them! Go now! The private! At number two, we have The War Below. The film takes place in 1917 during the Great War and follows British miners who were recruited to tunnel under German trenches where they could place and set off explosives. It's a film that runs at a frenetic pace and contains some truly tense and gripping moments. Unfortunately though, The War Below is definitely the most hidden movie on our list, only showing up in the UK region. But remember, just because it's not in your region doesn't mean you can't watch it. You can always use a VPN to switch regions if you don't know how to do that, you can click on the link in the upper right corner or in the description below and I'll show you how. Somebody needs to go down there and get them straightened out. No way, it's hot as hell down there, Pitts. Let me go down. Speed up the whole deal. And our number one hidden gem war movie on Netflix is The Last Full Measure. The story follows U.S. Air Force pararescue man William H. Pitsenbarger during the Vietnam War, in which he would help save the lives of over 60 of his fellow soldiers. An incredible true story, The Last Full Measure also details the struggles by many of his fellow veterans to get him recognized for the Medal of Honor years after his death. The film's main purpose is to have a great man's story finally be told, and luckily it does so here with great success. You can find The Last Full Measure in the UK and Canada. And you can check out five more Hidden Gem war movies on Netflix with the video you see here. That's it for today, everybody. See you soon.